guys, my name is Irene and this is my channel. So today I did this Jaclyn Hill inspired look. Before you watch this, just know I will be posting more videos often. Not consecutively, but I will be posting more, so please stay tuned for that. Please subscribe, it would mean so much. Anyways, enough of all that talking. If you want to see how I achieve this Jaclyn Hill inspired look, please keep watching. So first I'm going to be prepping my face, just kind of like waking it up and moisturizing it. And I'm going to be using the Organic Wild Sage Hydrogel Facial Toner. I'm going to be doing my eyebrows really quick off camera. So today, guys, I'm going to be using the BH Studio Pro Ultimate Artistry Shadow Palette. I'm going to be taking this peachy shade right here. I'm going to be going in with this burnt type orange. I'm going to go back in with the brush that I used the first shade in. And I'm just gonna go in the top. I'm gonna go in with this red, this dark red shade right here. I'm gonna be going in with that dark brown to put apply some on the outer and the inner corner of my eye. I'm gonna be doing a halo eye and I'm gonna be taking that born this way concealer. I like to look up after I add concealer. You can see my line finishes right there. Shade right here in this palette, and I'm gonna be adding that. I'm gonna be patting it on and then kind of just patting upward. And so now I'm gonna be taking that glitter primer. Natural Beauty by Glitter Injections. I think this is a glitter vial. So an orange, a really beautiful orange shade. And then this champagne color. That's what it reminds me of, like a champagne colored glitter. I just did this eye off camera really quickly. And all I did was I added this darker shade first. Then I added this lighter one. Now I'm gonna go in with that light blue and I'm just gonna continue going all the way to the inner corner of my eye. I'm gonna start off with the Wet Wild Photo Focus Foundation. I'm in the shade Soft Beige. So I'm gonna use the Photo Focus Concealer by Wet n Wild. I'm in the shade Light Medium Beige. I really like this concealer. It's pretty good coverage. Like, it's really good. I don't know, I like this. And I've tried a lot of drugstore concealers. Now I'm gonna take my mini it's wet as well, and I'm just going to be blending it all out. Okay, so now I'm going to be baking my face with the Airspun Loose Powder. I think I'm just going to pat some on, just because when I do bake my face, it dries out my face. I'm gonna be using the Physicians Formula. I think this is the Eclipse bronzer. It has a cute little, I forgot what those things are called. Shooting stars, oh yeah, shooting stars. And I'm just gonna be using an angled brush. I've been trying to use different brushes, different techniques, and I'm just going to be bronzing my face.
go with my Milani blush. This is the Blossom Time Rose. And this is, well, I think this is a powder blush. I don't know if it's the shade is Blossom Time Rose or if the shade is 11. I don't know, but it's really pretty. So I'm just applying to my apples with my cheeks. And I'm not really like brushing it on. I'm kind of just like patting it and swishing it around a little bit. Now I'm going to be setting my face with the NYX Dewy Finish Setting Spray. Time for highlight. And I'm going to be using the Tarte Goddess Glow Highlighter. So pretty. Look at this. This is so beautiful. And I'm going to be taking a fan brush and I'm just going to be applying it. And then onto the bridge of my nose. And then I'm going to apply some to my brows. And under my brows. Then I'm going to add some more setting spray. For the lips, I'm going to be adding this Tardiest Lip Paint. I really quickly forgot to tell you that um, I added some more orange glitter to my eyes and I just added some liquid highlighter onto my collarbones and shoulders. That was the L'Oreal Paris True Match Lumi Liquid Glow Highlighter in the shade hmm, Ice Glaze. If you want to know where I got all my products and everything, I'll list all the websites and links down below. If you like this, subscribe as well. Don't forget to subscribe. I enjoy making this just like I enjoy making my other tutorials for like my social media. Um, if you like this, please give it a thumbs up and tell me your thoughts and opinions on it. Let me know if you have any requests on any kind of look. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time.